And all right. So, hey, we're on. Uh, so this is, uh, this is William Goodwin. Did I say that right? Yep. yep. Awesome. Uh, from, uh, from Everipedia. He reached out to me yesterday uh, talking about uh, um, doing a, a, a mission to have us start creating the, uh, the Shipple Everipedia page. I was like, man, I got to get, get him on, uh, on a video so we can actually talk about what it is. I have a basic idea of what Everipedia is, uh, but I'd love to hear more personally, and I definitely want to, uh, to give – our uh, our community a chance to, to understand what this is because I think people are just starting to understand that the EOS ecosystem is a lot bigger than uh, uh, than what they imagined uh, and I think we're actually even as a community as a whole ecosystem just scratching the surface so it's going to be really cool to to see you know to kind of help uh, all of our people understand what you guys are doing and that this is a heck of a lot more than just a place where you could build uh, kind of cryptocurrencies or whatever so uh william if you could you know fill, fill us in on you know give us the thirty thousand foot view for uh, for what what's going on over at uh, everpedia sure um everpedia is the first uh wiki on the on the blockchain so that's absolutely incredible you have wikipedia which has billions of pages page views a month and you know hundreds of thousands of contributors and they don't get paid for anything right so all that contribution all that time it goes for nothing it's just you know to support a wiki which is cool but i think that you know you should own your content online if you're going to make something you should be reimbursed for it simple oh, as yeah. that um so basically that's what we do is uh, we have a uh, if you have an eos account you can sign up you can make edits uh, you can create pages people it's de everything's democratically voted on so um if uh you know there's no edit wars there's no admins who can come in and say this doesn't meet our notability guidelines it's going to be deleted it's just basically a very democratic platform so it's a decentralized wiki where there's just fewer notability requirements so everything's fair game you know as long as it's encyclopedically written as long as it's uh, you know not too obscene <laughs> uh, things like that you know you can add anything that you'd like um when it comes to the shipple page i think uh, the coolest thing is that you know we have uh, GIF and meme support and all that kind of stuff, so you can really deck it out with a ton of personality. Oh, no. it, doesn't have <laughs> it doesn't have to be a blank, you know, a, a rigid, you know, this is what Shipple is, this is the history of Shipple. You know, it, it can be anything. You can highlight all the fun memes, you can, you know, talk about the future of Shipple, where it's going. Right. So, yeah, so I mean, the whole idea of Everpedia is to just to create fun pages that are scholarly, but at the same time, you know, they give you like, you know, it should just be a fun way to, to contribute to a wiki platform, I guess. Right. So, yeah. And the thing, the thing that we're, uh, uh, that you're working on, we're going to announce a little bit later on today. Basically, what's going to be going on is we're going to encourage the Shipple community um, and incentivize them deeply uh, to, uh, uh, as, a, as a big old uh, uh, shill mission. Uh, and I think we might be adding some uh, some IQ tokens too, which is really fun. But basically incentivizing them to go and start this thing out, right? Like Wikipedia, it was designed to be run by its community. It totally is. People go and go there and, 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 and describe that kind of thing. So could you maybe describe that part? Let's say there's like, there's 10 people in the Shipple community right now. And I can actually almost tell you who they are that are gonna be like, oh my God, let me add this thing. This sounds great. You know, what what are they going to be sort of encouraged to do from the jump? Sure. Basically, uh, the cool thing is that they already have EOS accounts, so that's huge. Like, yes. uh, you can sign on and make a edits on Everpedia without an EOS account, but you won't earn any IQ. So, as soon as you make any edit on Everpedia with an EOS account, you're going to earn IQ. You'll get, you know, you'll get dividends, basically. Nice. Um, nice. But so, yeah, basically, what they're going to do is just uh, go in and edit the page. Right now, it's just a blank stub page. There's nothing about it. There's no history behind Shipple. You know, we don't even know who you are. Um, <laughs> So, so yeah, I mean, just basically the idea is just to beef it up and have it be the de facto page for Shibble, uh, you know, just as if it were your Wikipedia page, okay. which Wikipedia probably wouldn't let you have, even though you have a huge community and tons of things going on. I think that's the one thing that bothers me about Wikipedia is that it's not a true encyclopedia, you know, it's just everything is given a notability requirement. And I think that kind of acts as a loophole for them to, you know, be gatekeepers, say, we don't want this, we want this content. And right. uh, yeah, so so basically that's all it would be. It would be uh, taking the page, making it as good as it can possibly be, and uh, just adding a lot of personality to it. Well, the personality we have in spades. <laughs> um, so what, uh, um, you know, is, is, is Everpedia just going to be doing that, or do you guys have, have other plans? Like, what's, what's basically, what's your rollout plan at Everpedia for the next, uh, for the next couple of years? We've got a ton of stuff planned. Like it's, I it's, had it's, a feeling. It's insane when you get that. I mean, uh, Everpedia itself, uh, the founders, he's working on three different companies. So it's like, it's, it's insane. So basically, our first rollout is going to be getting the wiki aspect of it perfect. We've got right. a redesign that just happened and it's looking beautiful. The editor's easier to use than any other wiki in the world. 
Um, basically, we're going to be adding uh, other language support. And I think uh, they're doing a really cool thing where they're developing an IPFS protocol to uh, bring pages because we scraped all of Wikipedia and we can, you know, uh, make those pages better and whatnot. But we can also take those pages and use the IPFS protocol to bring them over to China and Turkey and places where Wikipedia is blocked. So we're oh, hopefully shit. okay. Can you tell me what an IPFS? Did I say that right? Protocol is because yeah. again, you have to understand. And this, like, and I'm so proud of this. It was not intentional, but I'm so happy that this is the case. Eighty percent of the people that are at uh, Shipple Basecamp are like, "What the hell is cryptocurrency?" Like they're they're using this as the learning and onboarding thing, and I really really love that. So anytime I don't understand a term, you can bet your ass that they don't understand it. So what is an IPFS protocol? Well, see, I know that I know the acronym is Interplanetary File Storage, but I honestly right. cannot get into the nitty gritty. Dude, way to bury the lead, Interplanetary File Storage. Like that is <laughs> the best, like the, when not to use an acronym right there. <laughs> that's, that's awesome. But it, but basically, to, to, yeah, not not needing to understand how it works because I wouldn't get it anyway. Yeah. But the whole idea that you can, you know, as you said, you can scrape wikipedia you can get the information off of wikipedia and actually reorganize that in a way that uh, uh you know countries where wikipedia has been blocked can actually access it that's pretty that's a big deal exactly you know billions and billions of uh, potential contributors you know and it's wow. actually it helps because eos is really popular in china too so or legit but uh yeah so we got that going on and we have predict coming it's a wage market um you may have heard of auger yes uh, it's basically Augur, but it's on EOS, so it's got a. It, it can handle the transactions per second. It's built for what Augur should be, you know. So right. I mean, when you think about that, so basically we're going to be having a, a whole IQ ecosystem where you can earn IQ on Everpedia, you can wage it, you know, bet it on a Predict. Uh, so eventually, there's going to be things like a uh, Quora for IQ. You know, anywhere where you add knowledge is yeah. uh, what we want to. That's that's our mission. Is if you add knowledge, you should get paid for that knowledge in the IQ token. I, um, that's that's brilliant and it's amazing too like even shipple which of course started out as a joke token within two weeks people were like hey could we do this could we do this could we do this and the answer is always like uh yeah yeah we could totally do that and so like this joke token is going into a thing where people are just uh, like automatically talking about the shipple ecosystem and i'm forced to be like yeah that checks out it shouldn't it's crazy <laughs> but it, like, and it really is because of the i think the versatility of the tools inside the EOS ecosystem is, is, is allowing us to do that. We can really port that into like a bunch of different things really quickly. And right, like even as it grows exponentially, which the, the user base for EOS is absolutely gonna do, the, they're gonna be able to handle the throughput where Ethereum couldn't. Ethereum got brought down by CryptoKitties. One CryptoKitties, killed it, right? Like, and, and you know, EOS is gonna be able to handle that in its sleep, so it's exciting stuff. That's cool, man. I'm so glad that you guys are going in all those different directions. Um, yeah, yeah. Uh, right now it was tough because, you know, there, there, were, uh, there were growing pains, you know, uh, we went on yeah. the blockchain and everyone didn't know what the blockchain was. So we, we lost most of our initial editors because they were just like, I have to buy an account to now do this. And it was, uh, you know, it was a big shakeup. But, uh, right. but yeah, so I, that's why I love what you guys are doing because like, you know, like you said, 80% of your community doesn't really know what cryptocurrency is. And they're, that's, they're uh, use, yeah, they're using this to learn, which, which is super fun. And, yeah. and, you know, and we want to be welcoming, right? Like I remember what it was like to not know. Um, and you know, people are coming in because the memes are freaking hilarious. And then they're asking questions like what, you know, what the hell is cryptocurrency? And I'm like, yeah, I want to answer this question 24 hours a day. This is what I <laughs> absolutely love doing. Um, and, uh, and, and that's really fun. So yeah, we, yeah everybody has the OS accounts already and they're going to be really, really excited to come in and build with that. It's one of the other things too, like, and, and I, I need to, 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 to reach out to, to some of you super smart types. There is an entire, you know, we moved into Shipple tribes. So, you know, last week, I was going to launch this like two months from now, but everyone was like, hey, I have this idea and this idea. I'm like, you guys all are going to get the fuck out of Basecamp because it's too many ideas. So we basically have, you know, tribes started where we've got the Filipino tribes at 160 people already. They're growing like crazy. Uh, but one of the things that started, I think it was the second one, was Shipple Up, which is basically a tribe where they just want to bet with Shipple. Um, and the one thing that they need the most is like a trustless way to have something that can have escrow, right? Like right now, like we've got shill masters, basically like tribal leaders in, in every organization that are kind of acting as arbiters for any of those kinds of things. Um, but if you know of anyone that can make a simple version of that, uh, uh, or at least explore the idea, I would love to meet them because there is a huge demand for it. Um, yeah, that's, that's, that's very interesting. We're doing a, so we're creating a delegation protocol on uh, Everpedia where you can basically set up big pools of IQ for a team or a tribe to, to use uh, and like, you know, clean up pages and just sort of like, nice. uh, yeah, yeah. So I think that's something sort of similar to what you're saying. It might sense. be, yeah. Yeah, uh, yeah. Uh, 
Yeah, I'll talk to, uh, to, the, to our CEO and, and uh, see what his thoughts are. Awesome. All right, cool. Uh, so is there anything else that you want to, uh, to tell the, uh, the Shipple team before we take off? I know you're, you guys are going to have a post up. We'll put it up in Basecamp later on today. Uh, and we're, I'm super excited about that. I know people are really going to dig it. But any message to, uh, uh, to the community? Um, no, I guess just uh, I, I love what you guys are doing. Just keep, keep the memeing up and, uh, you know, just come see me on Everpedia. Oh, yeah. All right. Thanks, man.